Hi guys. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing on how to fight Pinguagula update. On my previous video, I was talking about how to fight Pinguagula in three months by drinking radish juice for three months, and I said I would do, I would do it in the next video after six months. And I think now it's already six months, I guess. So I have to address that. So my previous video on my other accounts, I was talking about how to drink, how to fight the pink wagula by drinking radish juice for like about three months with empty stomach. Some changes, especially my burning sensation, irritation sensation, you know, <laughs> in my eyes. It was my main concern how to eliminate that. Like it's really drained my energy whenever I have this painful in my eyes. It just makes me tired. I'm sure all of you guys who watching this video is looking for a solution on how to, to, to eliminate this kind of problem, right? So you know what is pink, pink wakula is. It just also it doesn't look good on your eyes. I actually have two of them, like in my right side and my left side. So in my right side, I have two, but very, very small. Like you can't even notice. And the other one is big. So my last three months I feel like gone. I don't feel this sensation anymore. Many weeks that I didn't drink radish juice for, I don't know, like many weeks. So I'm starting to um, get back the feeling, the painful, the irritation and the burning sensation, I just can't open my eyes. It hurts, it's just annoying me, you know? I'm starting to figure out what's happening. I just noticed like, because I, I've been busy a lot in filming and I was uh, surrounded with artificial light, like right now. It's all, so I continue to drink radish juice more now. And I also start to like, you know, wearing sunglasses everywhere. I stepping outdoors. Now I'm starting to use my um, eye drop so I start to use it now when I, it hurts me. I will keep updates next three months whatever and I also heard about this stuff um, castor oil help with the dry eyes so I've been using this for about a month. I don't do it often but I don't know but I will keep update on it how it, I, because I think it may help with my pink pink wakula <laughs> so I think it might help so I just put in a drop like this and I drop one each before I go to sleep I don't recommend for you guys to use this you may want to do your own research first my recommendation is drink radish juice every morning with empty stomach the recommendation is you need to wear sunglasses every time you step outdoor because the concept behind that is like when you grow plants or any plants and you cover it with something so the plants won't grow but won't die as well. So it's same thing as your pink wakula. It won't, it doesn't uh, see the sunlight, the UV ray, the sunlight, so it won't grow. They won't go away as well. So that's it for now and I hope this helpful and I'll see you guys in the next video for